Hi, I'm uh, Grégoire Riffo. Uh, I'm the owner and manager of the Dynamo in Saint Gilles, the craft beer bar, and I co-organize the uh, Soif Brussels Craft Beer Festival with uh, Seb from the Barboteur and with Antoine from Multitax. And this is the third year of your festival. How have you seen it progress? Oh, there is a lot of progress actually. So we basically went from a festival in Scarbeck, which was the first edition, which paved the way to what it is now, with maybe like a lot of breweries, but we had to a bit find the public, find uh, the, the good formula to work. And now we, we are third edition, we try every time. We move to the, this castle in uh, Molenbeek with a beautiful lake and a beautiful outside space. And uh, now we, so the third edition, we try to build on what we achieved on the second one to make it even better like on the third one. And how many people do you expect over the course of two days? So the two days we probably target like 2,000 people, not too much, otherwise we lose like the, the nice cozy atmosphere that we managed to achieve like the two first years. Uh, but like the space, the outside space lets us at least put like 2,000 without a problem. And today we're asking brewers what are they doing to be green or trying to be green or trying to be part of their local communities? Do you, is SWAP or involved in that kind of... Yeah, actually that's the main purpose of the festival in the sense that we uh, try to bring craft beer to people in Brussels that don't necessarily drink craft. So we try to have a low uh, entry price and keep it very easy in terms of like the tokens uh, and keep it as simple as possible and offer other activities as well. So some good music, some food, some uh, bouncy castle for the children so that families can come. Uh, sometimes we have people like last year we had that like people like just walking in the park um, seeing that something was happening and entered so you had like dogs in the in the festival because they were just like going around with their dog and they saw that a beer festival was happening in the festival in the castle and they just entered so we really tried to keep it as easy for people as possible and remove the barriers that sometimes craft beer out of a bit snobism try to put